Hello and welcome, this is Noah with Nomad Gaming and thank you for joining us for another video about the Marvel Champions LCG. Of course, Marvel Champions is a living card game produced and distributed by Fantasy Flight Games and if you are looking for a place to stay up to date on your content, news, strategy, and gameplay, please click that subscribe button and sign up to get updates from our channel. We are here today for a gameplay session. We will be featuring Doctor Strange versus the Immortal Claw. Um, let's go ahead and jump over to the gameplay and check out what's got we've got already going on in the setup process. So as you can see, we've got Doctor Strange on the table, and we're going to move a couple things. So let's see, unanchor that guy, move all these guys down here, make things bigger. All right, visibility up. Let's see, we're in the middle of setting up here. We've gotten our two side schemes out. We are going to flip this guy, which tells us then to search or discard until we get a minion. Let's set visibility here so that we can see it. There's a minion first try. Let's give him a tough. Let's put our obligation in and shuffle and add threat here there's three and three all right let's take a look at our hero side this is our invocation deck here we need to be able to see the top card of that i believe that should be shuffled i don't know we'll try there we go all right shovel that up and shuffle up our deck one more time to avoid allegations of setting it up for us first, our starting hand size is going to be six. One, two, three, four, five, six. And not too shabby. Um, interesting. Mm-hmm. Magic Blast is useful. We could do an under surveillance and a magic blast to get rid and clear this guy. I think we'll keep this and uh, see where we go from here. Uh, the top card uh, is the confuse and remove for threat. So we could do that to get rid of one of our side schemes. Actually, I'll probably do that and then maybe do quake. Yeah, let's do that. All right, so we are going to flip and Let's get going. All right, so the plan here, we're gonna flip. We're going to exhaust Strange to play the top card of our invocation deck. We're gonna pay Magic Blast for that. And we will confuse the villain and remove four threat. We're gonna take the threat from Immortal Claw to avoid the acceleration. So that is cleared. Um, there's an argument to play followed before we do that, but we have tough on the uh, guard minion here, so it's not going to do us a lot of good to do that. Uh, we're going to put this under surveillance on the main scheme to help slow things down for us a little bit, and then we're going to play Quake, and we will play Quake for two. I will use Quake for one damage to clear the tough off of the armored guard. Uh, which will give us some more options on the next turn to deal with him uh, so that maybe we can throw the stun on the villain as well. All right, moving on. Let's see. Maybe it's a very cramped hand zone. I really wish we could get rid of this portion of the window here, but it stays forever. All right and we will add a threat to the main scheme we are playing on heroic today or not heroic we're playing on expert today but regular difficulty expert um, so we need to add a threat we get attacked by claw okay, claw whoops that's the draw button don't draw cards there we go we're gonna take two boost guards from claw and let's see, do we want to defend? I don't think so. So he attacks for a one plus two, three, four, and we have to discard three cards. One, two, three. 
So one, two, three, four, we'll take four damage. And we get attacks for one by the guard. I'll take that too. We're gonna get an encounter card here, which is power drain. Discard two cards from the encounter deck and then choose to discard one resource uh, for each boost icon discarded this way. Choose. <clears throat> All right, so I'm discarding two. One, there's no boost on that. Two, there are three boost icons on that. So I have to discard three inner, or three icons from my hand. Or three, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah just basically got to discard three cards. That's not good. Um, all right, we'll go one, two. I wanted to play that magic blast. Guess that's not going to happen. Um, three. Okay. That sucks. All right, my turn. Um, just all the well-laid plans that we've had have been thrown out the window, haven't they? All right, uh, let's go ahead and thwart two off a of power drain, clear that, and take a sip of water. <coughs> Excuse me, clear things up there. All right, get power drain off the table. Um, we could way overpay to clear that minion. I mean, it's the only thing we can do. Oh, we can't. We're not exhausting. This is not God. Let's flip. I think we just flip and draw. So, see what happens. All right, advance the threat by one. There's no scheme because he's confused. This guy schemes. I'll exhaust Quake to do two damage to him. He does zero when he schemes. And then I will take an encounter card. That encounter card is gang up and it is a surge card. Surging, that's a surge card, surging. That's a surge card, surging. Illegal arms factory. All right, so three threat there. <coughs> Got a frog in my throat today. All right, three threat there. And let's go to my turn. Um, I could exhaust, or I can just discard the top card. Um, do I wanna do that? No, I think I wanna play that card. All right, let's flip. I can't play that card. Grummity, grummity, grummet right there. That's how I feel. All right. Um, <clears throat> so I can't play it because I have to exhaust Strange to play it. And I need to get rid of this guy to be able to deal damage there. So we're not, let's actually not do that. Let's do, let's exhaust strange to heal three. And then we can, I guess we could stay in alter ego, but and set, just do all this setup stuff. That might be better. So we'll play Eye of Agamotto. We'll play, I'm tempted to just get this Sorcerer Supreme out there. There's a lot of boost, or this target acquired out here. There's a lot of boost abilities, but I want to draw more cards. So I'm going to play that for two. I know I could have used this resource, but I want to draw more cards. And we'll pass the turn. All right. So, threat goes up by one. There's no acceleration icons over here, right? We're just going to get two encounter cards. 
Uh, we're going to get schemed upon for 2 plus 1. That's 3, so we're at 6. Um, we've got the under surveillance, so this has got to go to 10 before it advances, so we can work that back down. He schemes for 0, but I'll exhaust Quake and deal 2 damage there. Encounter card, bonus encounter card for the arms factory. Shadows of the Past, which is, you know, not at all objectively terrible. Um, it is objectively terrible in case my sarcasm is lost in my oddly baritone voice today. Um, we're going Dark dimension -y here. This, let's see, hold on. Let's get all these things on the table. Let's get our stuff in the discard pile and shuffle these into the deck and all right up here open the dark dimension when reveal place the top card of the invocation deck face down under the scheme that's fantastic when the scheme is defeated shuffle the invocation card into the invocation deck so sidorax gone that's not bad though we got to go to winds of watum instead um we need to manage some threat anyway, which we can do with Astral. And yeah, we got rid of the minions, so the stealth strikes are worse. We could drop that followed to get rid of a future minion. And we've got a cloak of levitation now, and that's gonna be useful. Alright, let's see how second turn flipping goes. Physical toll. Oh my word. Alright, good thing we've got a cloak. Let's exhaust this and remove that from the game. Um, does it remove from the game? Yeah, physical toll. Exhaust Stephen Strange, remove physical toll from the game. Remove from the game, right there. Goodbye card. All right, now we have got a plan. We're gonna try to knock this out. We've got a lot of things to deal with on the table. We wanna get our card back. We need to manage some threat. We need to manage this threat. We can't do that until this is gone. So let's have some fun. All right, our turn. Um, well, we're gonna flip. And we're gonna play Cloak for one, two. We're gonna ready. We're gonna exhaust to play Winds of Watum. Winds of Watum says draw three cards. I will draw three cards. Put Winds of Watum into the invocation discard pile. And now we've got Wong as an option. We've got Master of the Mystic Arts, which would have been cool to have with the Winds of Watum. Vapors of Valtor is a much less fun card to play twice. Um, let's see. We do have something we can poke with our damage, though. When he attacks, discard the top card of our deck, and we get all these extra effects. So we can... We could do mean things like deal with that. Um... All right, let's Astral Project, discard Daredevil and Protective Ward for now. That's going to be three. We get to we remove three. We're going to do that from – let's do that from Open the Dark Dimension. Yeah, that gives us an option to... No, we can't... Oh, well, we could play it with this. Okay, let's do that. We'll take three off of here. And this shuffles into there. And we have Rings of Ragador. That's going to be fine. We could put tough statuses on a bunch of people. All right, Astral Projection goes away. We have more need to manage threat. Um, this doesn't manage threat, that doesn't manage, let's just get Wong down. Alright, Wong is out, Wong is going to, I think Wong is going to attack, to put him in a range that he could die depending on what we draw. All right, we get an extra card because of the Sorcerer Supreme, and 
Well, that's interesting. We could really use that Winds of Tomb over here right now. All right, and Villain adds a threat. He attacks. He gets two boost cards when he attacks again. Um, we're going to take the attack undefended and take three, four damage. And then we're going to get attacked by Baron Mordo. It says when he attacks, discard the top card of your deck. And then we have to do all those mean things. We got a physical resource, so we are stunned. Add stunned. All right, and we're taking two damage. Um, yeah, we'll do that. Uh, this guy's gonna attack for one. Um, let's defend it with Wong. Wong's got two damage now. One from last time that I didn't add, and one from this time. We'll take an encounter card. The encounter card this time is discard two cards from the encounter deck, take one. Indirect damage for each boost icon discarded this way. Well, we just lost the game probably. Let's find out one That's one damage Two oh, that's not a boost icon. All right, sweet. All right, we didn't die. We're close to die. You gotta remember that uh, Power drain's got direct damage hashtag don't fail in life. All right, and Hero phase here. Let's see what we can do all right, um, well, we should do a bunch of stuff, ready, flip, and heal. Um, we could ragador ourselves and some protection against getting hit. We should stealth strike this guy so for three we'll pay one two three so we'll deal four damage there he dies from the four damage we can remove two threat we'll take it from here that's gone and We can thwart for two to get rid of the defense network and then we can ready and we can flip and we can heal. We can play Sanctum. We can activate Sanctum, which means it says we can put a spell from our discard pile. I'm going to take Master of the Mystic Arts, probably. No, let's take Astral Projection. Shuffle that into the deck. And shuffle. Draw a card. Ooh, we got it. But it's a hero action, and we're not a hero anymore. All right, we're going to keep these and not do anything with quake right now because she can just knock this guy off in a second when he thwart or when he schemes we are probably going to lose the first scheme here but we'll make do life is good let's go all right on to phase not die all right advance the threat scheme oops popped out an extra one that'll be our card in second there we go this is one two three we're up to eleven so this goes discard pile we go next scheme um we mess up all of our pretty board because that flipped up there let's figure out what we can do about that all right uh discard cards from the encounter deck to discard a minion so let's see discard Discard, minion, yay, another guard, minion, hate guard, minion. All right, add a tough to him, discard that, flip this, flip that guy, and we're an alter ego, so he heals for damage. It doesn't happen because he doesn't have any damage, so he gains surge. Surge gives us another guard minion because we love guard minions. And add tough, so we gotta kill the guard minions before we can damage uh, claw and 
that's all well and good, but it's also terrible. Oh, we forgot. He, uh, he adds one to that. And I don't know why it's dark or it's fady fady. Um, but we'll exhaust her to smash him. And okay, that was a little out of order, but it's my turn anyway. So we're going to go ahead and make things happen. Um, we should heal for more. We should put a spell back into our pile and draw a card. Look at all cards. Uh, spell, spell, spell. Magic Blast? Yeah, we could do that. It'll help us clear off bad guys. Uh, we could master. Master's not a. That's important to know. Master is not a spell. That's just a statement of fact. All right, Magic Blast into the deck. Shuffle deck. Draw a card. Extra counterintelligence is not good. All right, flip. Exhaust cloak to ready. Um, all right, let's go. Rings of Ragador for one. Uh, and that's going to let us do three tufts. Let's see if this works today. It doesn't add tough. Add tough. Add tough. All right, so we're tough. We are a tough army. Um, we can. Sidorak is so bad when I have these guard minions on the table. Arrgh. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna counterintelligence to try to keep us from losing the game. See, that's ideal. Um, what's the last one? Wong gets rid of that. Oh, vapors. Aha! <laughs> Let's get rid of your tough status cards, you little monkeys. There we go. That's all I have to say. Look at these guys. They're big, crushing meanies. I hate them. All right. But we can... Oh, I don't want to do that now, though. Next turn, we can. All right. We will astral project away... Um, Let's astral project away this arms factory. We get to look at the top card of the discard pile and remove extra threat from that scheme. There, we don't obviously get to do that because, um, but we get to know what's going to be. Ah, that's terrible. All right, uh, discard more cards from the encounter deck. All right, that's played. That's played. We could master the mystic arts right now. Actually, why don't we do that? No. Yes. No. No, because there's a chance we could double draw next turn. All right, we're going to keep here. Let's see what happens with the turn. Bad things, I'm sure. All right, advance the threat by one. Get attacked. He gets two boost icons. I'm going to take it. Uh, it's one, two, three, four. My tough is gone. We've got to discard the top three cards. One two, three, ooh, counterspell, that guy got away, all right, bye counterspells, uh, he attacks for one, I will take the damage, he the other one attacks for one, I will take that damage, we reveal an encounter card, the villain's gonna scheme, um, that's Fine. Villain schemes for two plus one and a boost effect that discards more, but you can't discard more when there's nothing in there, so you're scheming for three. Let's just discard counterintelligence to prevent that. Okay, and my turn here. We're going to.
turn? It's not my turn, is it? Oh, yeah, it is my turn. All right, there we go. Hero phase activated. All right, let's see. Things we can do. We can play Nick Fury. That's the thing we're probably going to do. Well, first we can Exhaust Strange to play Vapors of Valtor, and we can change this guy to a tough. And then we can change these guys to confu to stunned. Yeah. And then this all gets put back into there and reshuffled. We've got Ragador on top. Not anymore. Bye. Wong says no. Winds of Watum is on top. That's what we wanted to see. Let's play Master of the Mystical Arts. We'll play Winds of Watum and draw three. And then we'll put it back. I think we. I think we just shuffled. So we have to do an encounter card. Extra encounter card for the shuffle, but that's fine. Hmm, tough choices now. I need to get rid of some bad guys, though. If I play Fury, I can't play Coulson. If I play Coulson, I, now's the time to play Fury, though. All right, so I'm going to play one. So we're going to pay one, two, three, draw three. Mm -hmm. discarded three I have to discard a fourth and this one's going all right there we go okay so that's what we drew fix that now we're going to um, should I attack now I think so or should I thwart I think I should thwart let's thwart two with fury and then, oh, I don't have to throw it with Fury because I've got, I'm not, Stealth Strike. All right, so attack for two with Fury there. Stealth Strike for one, two, three on this guy. Deals four damage. He's cleared. We clear two threat. That's gone. And not going to attack with we can ready strange though and draw three more um, by playing Winds of Watum. That's going to give us the ability to play either Magic Blast or Counterintelligence. We're not close to dying at the moment, so I might hold the counterintelligence and throw a magic blast. But the magic blast is such a waste with. Oh, I can attack and use the top. All right, let's attack. She loses tough. That clears armored guard. Then I can magic blast claw for one, two, three. And then that's going to deal five. And we get to discard the top card of my deck and then do a thing. So discard, it's an energy resource, that's two more damage. And Magic Blast is gone and it is 
bad turn. All right, enemy's turn. Um, he attacks for two. We will take it with the tough status. Oh wait, I lost that tough status last time, didn't I? Yeah, that tough is gone. But I'll defend it with Nick. All right. Uh, one, two, three, four. Fury's gone. Those are gone. And counter card. We have two of them this time. First one is cancels a spell. That's fun. Those don't count as spells. That makes life interesting. All right, let's see. Images of icons so we can confuse the villain. Um, all right, it's our turn. It's not a spell. That's not a spell. All right, let's play images of icon four, one. And that'll confuse the villain. And remove four threat. We can ready and crimson bands, which will deal seven to the villain and stun him. We have to pay for that with one, two. Let's play counterintelligence for one, two. Uh, let's wong that away so that we can reshuffle. Why are there six cards in this discard pile? Look at all cards, because that's not in the right discard pile. Shuffle that up. We've got vapors on top again. That's fine. Um, all right, past turn, we have extra plus one hand size, which we've been forgetting about. And, <coughs> all right. Villainousness. He is stunned, so he does not attack us. We take an encounter card. It is a weapons runner. He surges when we reveal him normally, so we get a surge. This one's discarding until we hit a side scheme now, which we do right away. It's our favorite, the defense network. I say with some modicum of sarcasm. All right, let's see if we can clean this up now. Um, we've got to, oh, we didn't advance our threat, advance our threat too. All right, my turn. Hero phase, stuff to do, let's see. Let's wong that away. Winds of Watum to draw three cards. No. No, no, apparently if you do that with the cursor in the wrong place, you draw cards from the wrong pile. All right, and it'd be great if we could get a Sidorak right now, but we can't. All right, so we can start doling out pain though. All right, let's do, Stealth Strike for one, two, three. Clear you. Deal two damn or take two threat off of there. Let's ready. Let's thwart. Take the threat off of there. Let's haymaker for two to defeat this stage of the villain. I guess, I bet it doesn't, I had 14 and didn't defeat him, so we'll have to, we had to do her. All right, let her go. All right, that defeats the first stage of the villain. All right, he has toughness. And, 
we can play under surveillance to make sure we don't lose the game suddenly. And... We can play Master of the Mystical Arts to play... Well, that's going to stay on top. That guy by paying one which gives us a tough status card here and still haven't played a spell so counter spell sitting there not thwarting any of my day all right next card is all right added a threat to there we go i made it pretty again all right secret rendezvous gets a threat he attacks with two uh cards we will defend we will not defend we have tough one two three four five and we discard three cards one two three i forgot we have acceleration so there's two more on there from last turn and this turn let's add the acceleration marker to help us remember that and get rid of those we take no damage and our tough goes away and he's going to scheme for three actually we're going to cancel that did i keep the cancel no i didn't keep the cancel all right three four actually let's discard that and he'll only do for one all right that's fine i mean we discard it because we got another one in hand all right that's all manageable our turn now all right dr strange has got work to do let's wong away that seven rings of ragador let's play that images of icon so we'll take four threat off and we would confuse but he's already confused let's ready Let's play a counterintelligence to protect ourselves. And let's play Crimson Bands of Sidorak to protect ourselves. It's for two, that deals seven damage and stuns Ooh, whoa things got oh we got way too many things on him now oh he had tough shoot he had tough that sucks pay attention son all right <coughs> and draw our full hand one two three four all right and extra encounter card because we reshuffled let's reshuffle this deck into here shuffle winds of watoom that's good stuff all right two threat villain attacks two boost icons um I guess we have to defend that with Wong. Can't afford to die. One, two, three, four. Wong has tough. Two boost icons, or two, two of these mean guys. Let's see. I take two damage. Claw heals two damage. He has nothing to heal. He's gonna scheme for three plus one is four. Let's do this again. Counterintelligence that. And we have to discard the top three also. One, two, three. And that's good. My turn. Um, let's Winds of Watoom.
Oh wait, I didn't have to do that. He was stunned. Sweet. Give him my tough bag. Messes up all the rest of that, but we'll just let that go. For a minute, I don't know, whatever. Failed miserably there. Alright. But I don't like Vapors of Altor, so it's gone. Crimson Bands is here, though. That's a good day. We'll exhaust that, ready that, and play. Actually, we won't do that. We're going to play Crimson Bands using that. So, one, two. That goes back onto there. It deals one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and adds a stun. That's discarded. Then we will ready. We'll play Crimson Bands again for one. Two. It's going to deal seven more damage. I'll play the Haymaker to deal three more damage and pass the turn. Advance to remove stunned, get an encounter card, and encounter card is oh I didn't did I do the I didn't do my thing. I draw an extra card. Alright. Encounter card is under fire. It gains surge and reveals the top card. So that's two. Alright, this guy is going to discard two cards. And then I have to discard a card from hand for... I have to discard resources. Alright, let's see. One. There's none there. Two. None there. Alright, that's got two on it. It's got an acceleration icon, too, to be mindful of. We've got Mordo back on the table. Mordo's fine. Alright. <laughs> My turn. Um, I could throw tough around, but I'm not I might actually do that. Let's see. Let's attack Wong into him. Then we can well, can I just finish him? Can I deal five damage up there? Could actually, I think. All right, so if I attack, lose my tough, and deal two here, and then if I play Daredevil, one, two, three, four, and Daredevil attacks, it does two damage there, and then I attack and do a damage. That's defeated. All right, that's good to work. All right, this may have sounded anticlimactic there at the end. We were thinking way too hard, but we have uh, defeated Claw, and we are excited to be done. Uh, thank you for joining us for this gameplay session of Marvel Champions LCG. If you enjoyed this, please hit the like and subscribe button. Uh, subscribing to the channel really does give us a ton of help, and we really need you to do that. So thank you for supporting us in that way. Uh, look for more content coming forward soon. We're going to try to spice up and improve our gameplay content. Uh, and we have some other fun plans coming down the chain, so stay tuned, and until next time, let's go game!